Yes. No need to bundle up today, though, really, Jordan. Not at all. You could uh, you could definitely leave the jacket off. Oh, tonight you may want to put it back on. We're looking at a pretty clear and cool evening tonight, but some more changes ahead. Again, we're looking at more rain and snow by late tomorrow into early Monday, and that's going to leave some low snow by early Monday morning down to about 2,000 feet into the foothills. And then by midweek, we're tracking a very significant winter storm that's going to bring heavy rain and snow. Some of the models indicate up to seven feet of snow could be. Uh, Done by the end of this week at some of the higher summits. Right now, though, like we mentioned, a very beautiful evening and afternoon. This is a live look outside. There are holiday in camera. You can see the golden one off in the distance. We'll continue with clear skies and cooler temperatures. Right now, we are starting to see those numbers drop down. We got 55 in Sacramento as well as in Stockton. Modesto coming through in the low 50s and 57 degrees right now out towards Marysville. Our humidity at 51 percent, dew point at 37, and our winds right now training in from the north. On the lighter side, five miles per hour. Our pressure right now to 9.91. So as far as our temperature change from yesterday, we're actually a bit warmer this time around. We're about anywhere from five to ten degrees warmer here in the valley than we were just 24 hours ago. Again, we did see plenty of afternoon sunshine. That storm system that did bring us some rain yesterday afternoon here in the valley and some mountain snow did finally make its way down towards Southern California, where they are getting a nice little soaking, much needed rain from our state as we are all under a drought. Now, as we head into our Sunday and then next week. We got more storms coming through. So basically, we have an atmospheric river. That storm door has been opened. We'll start off again with some clear skies tomorrow, but increasing clouds and rain and more mountain snow as we head into our Sunday. By Monday, we start to at least dry out a little bit. We get a nice little break. And then by late Tuesday night into Friday, that's the major storm that we are tracking. That's going to bring us a significant winter storm. We could see totals here in the valley with rain close to seven inches and close to seven feet of snow this week up in the high country. Again, future cast, this is going to show rain and snow and the clouds rolling in by tomorrow morning. We should see some rain here in the valley after noon tomorrow. So this is 1.30 p.m. The green indicates the showers a little bit heavier along the coast. That is yellow and orange, and that will make its way into the valley. So we could see some pockets of moderate to heavy rains. But once the snow begins tomorrow afternoon, it's going to continue up in the high country and make its way down to the foothills early Monday morning. There we go, 5 o'clock. That is the low snow that we are tracking. It could get down to possibly 2,000 feet, even 1,500 feet in some locations. But it is going to be lighter on the lower uh, elevation spots there. With the future cast showing that we will see about ten, uh, about a tenth of an inch here in the valley with rain, and these numbers again will be increasing as we head towards midweek. And we'll show you this graphic that indicates all the heavier showers, uh, again closer to four to five inches of rain possible here in the valley. So slice of California again. We did see temperatures uh, that will be in the 50s for tomorrow. Temperature-wise, that we are tracking again uh, more rain and snow as we head into the upcoming day. So low temperatures tonight down into the 30s. So I hope I didn't uh, skip our seven-day forecast again. Though winds also picking up as well. We will be seeing those winds increasing as we head along the coastal range and into our area. Looks like I did skip our seven day forecast. We'll have that coming up at your 10 o'clock hour. Marley, though, I'll send it over to you.